In this video, I'll show you three free AI tools that you can use to automatically make one word subtitles that's powered by OpenAI's Whisper and these are available for Windows, Mac and Linux. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. Now, I do have my video right here, either of them, I can use them. And the first tool we're going to use is Subtitle Edit. Now, quick note, Subtitle Edit is not yet available more or less for uh, Mac OS, uh, but there's an uh, active development of Subtitle Edit Avalonia that is going to be available for Mac, Windows and Linux. Now, this Subtitle Edit, and this is the first of three. The third one is more or less the best, in my opinion, in terms of flexibility and the number of words you may want to create. So, uh, Subtitle Edit, the latest version, 4.0.13 as of 9th October 2025. So, I'll begin by adding my video open it up and it's right here and the next option is go to video audio to text whisper and this is where everything becomes important because the engine we want to use is puff views faster whisper this one and then the model you can choose whatever you have right here or download extra models down here so depending on the ram on your computer you can go for the big models this need more ram on your computer but i'm just going to remain with the base model that i have the important part here now, don't click on generate first, just go to advanced. And right here, you'll see extra parameters for the whisper command line. And by default, there'll be a different sample here, but this is the last one that I used, the one word uh, parameter. Now, you can see different options here for CPP, const, OpenAI, faster whisper, faster whisper, XXL, the one that I've selected. And they do have some templates down here. So let's say we go with single word is what we have. So if I click on highlight current word, you see it changes right there. But if I go for single word, what we want, we get that. I'll click on OK and then click on generate. And once I do that, it's going to transcribe my audio to text more or less into subtitles. There we go. And we have our one word subtitles. And if I play this, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to use Descript's eye contact feature to simulate eye contact with the camera even when you're reading from a script. So we now have a one word subtitles. You can make edits to everything that you want. For example, this one I know is Descripts, D-E-S, scripts and whatever. You can make your changes, but that's the first step. Let's assume you wanted to save it as an SRT subtitle file. Click on file, save as, and by default you'll get this SRT and then click on save. So I'm not going to save that for now. And then I'll just jump on to the next tool. And the next tool we're going to use here is Buzz, and Buzz is available for Mac, Windows, and Linux. Uh, more or less, if I actually scroll down here. So for Linux, you can get it via Flatpak or Snap. Uh, for Windows, the releases page. For Mac OS, from the releases page. Now, uh, the version I'm going to use is an older version. So as you can see here, the latest release is 1.2 as of November 24th, 2024. So I'm going to click on the releases page. And this is what I'm going to use, but the specific version I'm going to use because I've done a couple of tests is version 0 0.9 because as for the rest, for some strange reason, they are not working on my end. So this is a version I'm actually going to use. So uh, let's open it up right here. And from here, you'll get this particular interface. So let's just delete this. And the interface might be a little bit smaller, looking something like this. Just maximize it. And then I'm going to add the file that I want uh, to kind of make one word SRT subtitles for. And then change this to all files. Click on the video. Click on open. And once I do that, the dialog box to select the model I want to use, uh, the model size, uh, depending on what you have downloaded already, and the task is transcription. But of importance here is ensuring word level timings. So once that is sa I'm satisfied with that, I'll click on run. And it's going to begin the transcription. You're going to see some flickers on your computer and it's completed in four seconds. If I double click on this or click on this expand view, more or less open transcript right here, it's actually just double click, you'll be able to see that we have one word subtitles right here super super simple click on export as an srt and then you can export it 
to the folder that you want to have your one word SRT subtitles in. Now, uh, let's go to the last one. And this one is auto subs. And this one is available for Windows, Mac and Linux. Uh, so you have no issue whatsoever. And uh, more or less, what I'm going to do is just drag and drop. Let me go with this one right here. I'll drag that file there and then scroll down slightly. And you'll need to select the transcription model. And if you've not yet downloaded the models, uh, if you select the model here and click on start transcription, it's first of all going to download the model before the transcription process begins. So let me go with the base right there and then scroll down of importance is subtitle line rules. Click on this gear icon here for the settings and the word limit. I'm going to go with one. So the reason why I mentioned that this is more or less the best is because if you want two words, you can go with two. Let's go. You can do two, you can do three, you can do four, whatever. So let's go with one. We just want one word right here. Uh, just a single word. That's okay. And then I'll click on start transcription. Transcription progress is going on right there. And really it depends on how big your file is. If it's a huge file, it may take a while. And if you've got a GPU, always ensure that this is turned on because it improves on the transcription speed. So see what we have here? We've got these one word subtitles right there, which is super, super awesome to be able to do this uh, on free applications uh, powered by OpenAI's Whisper. And as I mentioned, if you wanted two, two words, you can do two and then click on start transcription, transcription progress. It's going on right there. Because there are scenarios where you may need two word subtitles. Let's see the results we're going to get. So you can see in this video, I'll show you two word subtitles, super simple. So that's why I mentioned that auto subs may be the best for different scenarios. As for bars uh, and subtitle edit, uh, you may need to play around with everything to see everything fits what you want. But that is how you can make one word subtitles using three free AI powered tools automatically. That's it for this video. I hope it's of value to you. Thanks for watching.